let's recall a very important reaction given by the alkenes and alkynes that is the reaction with ozone so let's start with the alkenes so we have ethene when it is made to react with ozone what do we get we get ch2 one oxygen atom comes in between the two carbon atoms and the other two oxygen atoms attach themselves to the two carbon atoms in this form so when ethene reacts with ozone this is the product that is formed which is known as an ozonide so in this case we have used ethene so we get the ethene ozonide so the reaction of alkenes with ozone gives us such a product in this case for ethene we get the ethene ozonide now let's take an alkyne we use ethyne ethyne is now made to react with ozone so when alkynes react with ozone they form a hard kind of a structure so in this case we have two carbon atoms and the oxygen atom attaches itself in this form so one oxygen atom bonds to the two carbon atoms and the other two oxygen atoms attach to the two carbon atoms and they form a bond between them as well so this is also an ozonide in this case we have used ethyne the common name of ethyne is acetylene so the product that is formed is ethyne ozonide or acetylene ozonide so when we carry out the ozonolysis of ethyne we get a hard kind of a structure which is known as acetylene ozonide so for alkenes and alkynes when the reaction is carried out with ozone we get a very important reaction which is known as ozonolysis